What's up, everybody? This is Bill. Uh, we're going to look at an app today. I'm going to do a review for you on Super Video Floating and Pop-Up. This is from uh, GPC. Now, the people over there at GPC, they give you a really good technical support. If you have any questions, you need some answers, uh, they sent me a free copy of their full app uh, to try out on my HTC One S. Absolutely love it. I thought I'd do a review on it for them. So uh, I hope they'll enjoy this review. So let's jump into it. I'm going to hit my home button. We're going to launch Super Video Floating. Okay, so I have my videos here. Uh, I'm glad you are subscribing. To we can exit up that. Let's see here. Let's go directory, my videos. You see how you can scroll through them here. Now you can hit this. You got a little square up here that changes it to a grid design or this type of design here so this is the way it lays them out okay and you can see here a really cool feature on it it actually reads what quality the video is so you can see this video here it says 1080p whereas this one it says 720p hit it again my videos now we've got a list view hit it again my videos so now we have this view this more uh, carousel uh, gallery type of view so you can go to played, and that'll show you all the recent ones that you've played. You can go to favorites. You can mark a favorite. Uh, directory, gallery. Now, when you're up, uh, let's see, we can open up a I'll video here. Every couple days. You see here, I have full access to move this around wherever I want. I try to keep YouTube okay, busy. I can uh, uh, click up here. You can see how that I makes can, uh, it look. Right over there. Click there again, a little bit different design. Uh, click there again, more like a video way. player type of design. I can blow it up full screen, right over there. shrink it down, Plus. I can minimize that video. Go to my movies, let's grab the second video, you got my son here playing on his four wheeler. He's out there in the yard, four by and around, playing around with him. So you can see here, we can minimize that. So now what we can do is we can go back to the home screen, slide our drop down bar, this is where it minimizes the video to. You see how that looks? You see there, I got two videos playing. Okay, hit the home button. Still have complete control of my home screen back here. No lag whatsoever. Okay, I can still open up an app if I want to. We can go to Instagram, check out some pictures. So we can go over to Instagram. If you want to find me on all my social networking stuff, uh, watch the intro video. Show you all the all the stuff that I'm on. I'm on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Google Plus. You find me on all of it. So you can see here how we can do this. We got a video playing here. We're looking at pictures on Instagram. Uh, we can actually hit this button here. We can go to our recent apps. Let's open up Dead Trigger and check out Dead Trigger. So this is gaming while videos are playing. You can see how that is. We can resize these. Uh, I'm glad you are subscribing to my YouTube channel. Let's get uh, this guy over here. Uploading new stuff every couple Let's days. resize him. I find all kinds of stuff to upload. Uh, I try to keep YouTube busy. You can see there. Uh, if you want to follow me, you can find me uh, right over there. You can see there, no lag whatsoever. It isn't interfering with the game. Right up that way. So we're going to finish watching our video, and, and we're going to play some there. Dead Trigger. So if you want a lot of customization and customizability on your Android device, go download Super Video Floating and do those developers a favor, pay for the full app. It's great, works perfect. The full app allows you to open up six different windows at once. So hit up their website, I'll leave some links in the description. And uh, check out what all they have to offer. They have several apps in the Google Play Store. Uh, they have a floating browser that I did a review on also. So be sure to check that out. 
floating browser next to the floating video. A lot of customization there. So anyways, that's floating video. Check out the link in the description. Go download the app. Hope you enjoy my video. Have a great day. Okay, everybody, another thing I wanted to show you real quick. This is on my HTC1S from T-Mobile. Uh, this is the uh, full version. So you can see here, if I open up something What's okay, up, and everybody? move it over, open up the one next to it, open up the one next to it. You can see how that works. So you can open up up to six tabs in floating video on the full version. Now, if I touch this one, another feature here is the option to fast forward and rewind. So just by touching the video, let's see, you touch the video down here in the bottom corner, you're fast forwarding 30 seconds every time you go all the way from one corner to the other corner. So I'm sorry this second video isn't all that great, I'm using a webcam on my PC. Anyways, you get the idea, super floating video from GPC, go download it, it's a great app, I'm telling you, you'll love it on any Android device. Deuces, hope you enjoyed my What's up everybody, this is Bill, uh, I'm glad you are subscribing to my YouTube channel, uh, continue to watch my videos. Uploading new stuff every couple days. I find all kinds of stuff to upload. I try to keep YouTube busy. Uh, if you want to follow me, you can find me uh, right over there on Instagram. Uh, you can follow me right up that way on Twitter and right over there on Facebook. And I'm also on Google Plus right there. Anyways, hope you continue to watch my videos. Uh, go ahead and give me the like button. Give me a thumbs up. Uh, hit that plus one button down there. And uh, make sure you read my description. I try to keep important information down there. Anyways, stay tuned for more videos. Deuces. Thanks for subscribing.